So in years past, I've always cut my lawn at about three inches tall, and I wasn't real happy with that. Sometimes I would lay over, didn't really care for it much. And when I did the renovation up here this year, I decided to leave my height of cut at about two and a quarter inches, and it looks freaking amazing. But today I'm gonna kind of do a little experiment here and take it down below two inches. This is all perennial ryegrass, so you can keep perennial ryegrass between an inch and a half and two and a half inches. I think I'm gonna take it down to an inch and three quarters and see how it looks. So, well, let's just get to it. So it's only been uh, two days since I last cut this, so I don't expect a ton of top growth in that amount of time, but I am going down another half inch. So what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna side discharge this, just to err on the side of caution, keep things from getting plugged up. And then I'll just come back and do a second cut and, uh, clean up the clippings. Um, I'm sure some of you are gonna ask, do I plan on real mowing this? The answer to that is no, I'm not gonna real mow this. I'm just kind of curious how this looks if I can get it down to about inch and three quarters. So we're about to find out. Look at that mess. Glad I decided to side, side discharge. Cause it just made a mess everywhere. Look at this. It's just stuff all over the place. But it doesn't look too bad. I'm gonna go back over it with the bagger and uh, clean this mess up. All right, well, I decided to blow off the sidewalk. It made such a mess everywhere. Get it all back up into the grass and well, now I'm gonna go through and cut it the opposite direction and, and bag all this mess up, but not too bad for not even trying to stripe, huh? Anyway, let's clean this up. Well, it didn't do as much damage as I thought it would. <laughs> um, pretty impressed. Uh, the super recycler handled it really well. Um, I'm glad I decided to side discharge and then go back and bag it because it did make quite a mess. Um, I don't see a whole lot of uh, damage anywhere. I didn't scalp anything that I noticed. Um, the only thing I have noticed, and I'll show you here in a second, is it's pretty common this time of year in the Pacific Northwest to have a little bit of rust disease. So some of that is showing a little bit more, but it, that's not uncommon, especially considering we had three inches of rain just a week ago. So not too worried about that. Rust disease won't kill the grass at all. You just push it out with uh, more nitrogen. So just something else to do. Um, but, you know, let me show you. All right, so overall, it doesn't look bad at all. I mean, I don't know, I can pick probably anywhere. Let's see, right here, or the sun where you can see it. But you can see there's a little bit of a, a little bit of rust disease in there. Not much, nothing I'm worried about. I just couldn't see it as well. Of course, you know, even double cutting, when you're cutting quite a bit off, you're gonna have a few stragglers. But I think it turned out uh, really, really well. I kind of like this height. I think I'm gonna try this throughout the winter and uh, 
see what it does maybe next year. So it's been about three days since I cut this, and as you can see, it greened right back up. Looks really, really good. So I'm curious, where do you guys like to keep your height of cut at? You go as low as a half inch, you go as high as four inches. Let me know in a comment down below, and uh, we'll see you in the next one.